Hey folks, Jiminy Critic here with a movie review for you for the movie She's Out of My League. That's right, the title is She's Out of My League and you can probably guess from that title exactly what this movie's about. It's a rom-com, a comedy romance. It's brought to you by Paramount Pictures. Um, it's rated R and deservedly so. <laughs> this is one of those movies I think that's geared toward maybe uh, the college age frat boys that uh, enjoy uh, hearing the, you know, the dirty language and some of the dirty jokes and things of that nature. I'll get to what's in the movie in a minute. It's about 104 minutes long and it's directed by Jim Field Smith. All right, on to She's Out of My League. It stars Jay Baruchel, kind of a new and upcoming actor. You might remember him as the one nerdy, sort of smart guy in the movie Tropic Thunder, you know, with Ben Stiller. Uh, and all then Jack Black and those guys. If you saw that movie, the one skinny, wiry kind of guy is Jay Baruchel, and he's up and coming now in some things. He plays Kirk in this movie. Alice Eve plays Molly, and then she's going to be the one who's out of his league. Uh, T.J. Miller uh, is going to be this character Stainer, and he has many of the funny lines in this particular movie. Miller, Mike Vogel plays Jack, and Nate Torrance plays his friend Devon. Well, the basic premise of this movie is Jay Baruchel's character Kirk and his three buddies that I've mentioned all work in Pittsburgh at the airport in various uh, and sundry duties. A couple of them in baggage, a couple of them, one of them in management, and two of the guys work for TSA. You know, the folks that check your baggage, make sure everything's safe, you know, terrorists can't get on board planes and things like that. Well, this main character, Jay Burrishell, his decision life is he's kind of not doing much with his life. He's working his job. He's kind of a slacker at heart, but you know what? Deep down inside, he's a very nice guy. He can be a polite guy. He doesn't like to hurt people's feelings. He doesn't like to do bad to his friends, even though they're jerky to him sometimes. And a lot of comedy comes out of the four of these guys talking together on their breaks at work or on the weekends when they do stuff together. Well, here's the setup for the movie. One point during the uh, airplane check-in time, this girl Molly, Alice Eve, comes in, and she's in a rush getting through. She's a very beautiful girl. And uh, as she goes through the checkout line, gets on her plane, she realizes that she has forgotten her iPhone. And Jay Baruchel, the main character here, has found the phone in one of the bins that you put your stuff in, you know, when you go through the checkout at the airport. He calls up the phone, or, and, or somebody rings the phone, he answers, and he is kind enough to take the time, even though it might be dangerous, to return that phone to her on the airplane while she, before she takes off. And when she meets him, she realizes, hey, I've been seeing a lot of jerks, and I might want to try going out with a nice guy. And Jay just can't believe that this girl, Molly, wants to go out with him, because the way the movie describes it, he's like a number five, he's a five, and she's a hard ten, so there's no way that any way could jump that chasm between the five and the ten. So a lot of comedy ensues. Are they going to get together? Is he going to realize that maybe he is good enough for her? Is she going to realize that she does want him or doesn't want him? Uh, and like I say, a lot of language and jokes and some dirty stuff goes on given this movie it's our rating. So um, you can get a few good belly laughs out of this movie, but just be warned. I thought there was a really sweet movie in this thing. It could have been maybe toned down a little bit and made in the PG-13 realm, but that's not who this was for. So while it's out, get a chance to see She's Out of My League.